for tuning in with our virtual programming for Jackson Heights Library Systems. My name is Jessica and I'm the branch manager of Lewis A. Flag Library here in Edwards, Mississippi. Um, with all that's going on with coronavirus and things like that, programming has been quite different but in a good way. We're still here able to provide services for you and we are excited about doing our virtual programs. Um, as some of you all may know, Grandparents Day is celebrated in the month of September. So this is our program for September. Um, Grandparents Day is often, it's overlooked. Um, so I created a short program for grandparents and little ones. Um, due to coronavirus, I feel that this particular activity would be perfect for the occasion. So this program is basically an interview with Granny. I say Granny because I interviewed my grandma for this program. Um, last year, we were able to physically do a program, which was um, we did coloring and craft activities with the grandparents and the grandchildren. So this year it is a little bit different but yet still fun um having children engage in discussions with their grandparents is an excellent way for seniors to feel included um, and and part of the activities um, this is also an added benefit for children to learn essential skills for conversing active listening and manners when speaking to their grandparents as well as other elders um, I did my interview with my grandma. I did three. I actually did a series of six questions. I did three serious questions and then I did three silly questions. So I'm going to go on the list and I'm going to read my questions and her answers. And we're going to go from there. So question one was, how did your family spend time together when you were young? Her question was, well, her response was, we ate breakfast and dinner together every day and had family game nights on the weekend. Now, families barely get to spend any time together because there are so many other things to occupy their time. Question two, did you have a best friend? Her answer was yes. And to this day, we are still best friends. And that is true because she comes over often to visit my grandma and she's basically family. Um, question three, what did your friends do for fun when you all were young? Her answer was they hung out at each other's home. Basically what we do now, um, we go over to our friend's house, spend the night, and just have a good time. Those were the three serious questions that I asked. I also asked her three silly questions. Um, the first question was, if you could have dinner with your favorite movie character, where would you dine and what would you eat? Her response was, I would cook steak and potatoes unless he wants something different and we would dine at my house because I love to cook. Y'all know I had to ask who that person was. Her response was Denzel Washington. The second question, silly question I asked her was, what are you most thankful for? Her answer was, I am most thankful for life and being able to still enjoy it as long as I have. The third question that I asked is, if you could switch places for one day with another family member, who would it be and why? Her answer was, no one. I am perfectly happy with who I am. These were the six interview questions that I asked my grandmother. Um, unfortunately, I was unable to ask my grandfather. He passed away on Christmas um, three years ago. So um, this was a very interesting interview and it was actually quite fun. I was able to spend time with her um, and just get to know different things about her. Which is, which is what makes it fun. Um, if you're unable to visit your grandparents to ask them the interview questions, you're always able to call them on the phone, have your questions in front of you, and as they give you the answers, write them out. If you are able to go and visit your grandparent, 
Don't forget your mask. This is very important. Grandparents, they are priceless and they have priceless wisdom and life experience to share. Encourage multi-generational conversations at your next family gathering. I want to thank you all so very much for stopping through and engaging in our um, virtual programming. Stay tuned. We have more to come. Happy Grandparents Day. Thank you.